Hey guys, and welcome to Lucius 2. Um, with this, this is a game where you play as the son of the devil, called Lucius. And the aim of the game is to basically follow the story as roughly as possible, because there isn't really much of a good story. The whole house burned down. But the aim of the game is to kill people in as many them. different ways. Possible. I managed to get the boy out. Um, this is basically showing you what's happened in the Charles first game. Behind the murders. Because in, in the these first game, burnt the down the, the mansion the that we were in. So I headed to the Brindic's hospital. The very and same hospital. According to this, we go to a mental hospital. It was only for fitting to visit treatment. once more. He was sitting quietly in the back seat, staring at me through the mirror. When we arrived just before the nurses came to get him, he leaned forward and whispered something in my ear. The hair on the back of my neck stood up as I was overwhelmed with emotion. The whispers kept running through my head that this was no ordinary kid at all. As I returned to my apartment, I started to put pieces together. They were all pointing at the boy. How could I not see this before? Was Charles right all along? Was I actually helping the devil's son? The boy was to blame. The yes. boy is the evil one. The boy is the one that killed those You're him. God's sake, aren't you? Are Satan. Come now. God's you have been able to sense it all along. Do you oh, decide there's been something telling you to do the right thing? But I'm. I'm Catholic? <laughs> yes. <laughs> so am I. We are all just part of his plans. My job is to make things slightly more interesting. And me, I'm also just a part of the plans. You have done what you are supposed to do, and you are going to do a lot more. We are only getting started here. And look at it this way: you are just serving the Lord in the end. Twist those words, making one of us one of us. The I'm just putting my little twist on the whole thing. We are all just fulfilling his wishes here. So, just relax and listen to what I have come up with for the boy now. <laughs> his eyes look like that of Anakin Skywalker when he turns to the dark side of the force. All along I've been a servant to the cause. You're I was meant to travel this world for the, the, the safety of Garak, And to protect his son. Now join me. Lucifer had a plan. <laughs> It's all for the good of the people. Nah. He'll have to look for the answers to this little game that's been created for him. The Dark Lord has taken his powers away and leveled the playing field. It will not be an easy task for the boy, but it's all necessary sacrifice that will, in the end, pan out the way it was supposed to. They evaluated the boy and committed him. He had lost his abilities to influence anyone. Thoughts of abandonment fell in his head. His thirst for blood was gone along with the rewards he'd already been given. It took six months until the boy was woken again. No blood was spilled. Someone up there was happy. It finally happened when they brought two new patients. <laughs> hey there, God. They both You're good a good job. You not killing a single soul. More interesting. The other one was a woman of the cloth. Immediately, Lucius realized that there was more that he had to do, so, in the blink of an eye, he attacked them. There was a fire inside him again. He was not forsaken. He felt useful again. However, the employees managed to put him down. They let him down. Lost kill, them. Lost kill, them. The boy had gathered a following throughout the hospital. Some of the patients naturally looked after the boy, but not these employees. They shackled him, imprisoned the prince. They laid him down on the bed, ready to be shocked. But what they did not know, and what they could not guess, is the answer to a question. What happens when you shock the devil's son?
Okay. Now the game is actually starting. It's actually getting going. Trying to retire the secrets and what Lucius did to these people. It's quite graphical, really. So if, if this game looks like it will be gory, I don't know how gory, I don't know if it's going to be comically gory, but I wonder if it's going to be gruesomely gory. If it's gruesomely gory, um, a little warning if you have a, a little, very light stomach and you can't, and you don't like these sort of games, then fine, fine enough, you don't have to watch it. But we get straight into this, we're going to kill loads of people, and there's a torso hanging from the ceiling, dripping with blood. Groovy. Right, so it's controlled with the WAS. Seems to be controlled with the WAS. D keys to uh, move around, and what happens if I do that? Okay, that sets that off, that starts that. And I'm guessing I need those keys. How do I get those keys? Right, there's a thing there. No. And if I move that onto him, what happens? Not a lot of doing Okay. Come on, give me those fucking keys. So now I need that. That doesn't seem to really do not do anything. Okay, well that's how th uh, that's throwing up. That didn't do anything. I didn't do anything either. I need the keys. Okay. Uh, let's have a look. I don't have any powers at the moment. Pick it up. Right. I need to zap this guy. I'm sure I need to zap this guy. How the fuck? Why is it zapping this guy? Do I need to attach it to something? Do I need to... Nope. Stop fucking dropping it. Let's see. Nope, that does bugger all. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, well that's done that with it. Oh, save. Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm a complete idiot. Right, a little collectible devil things, that's what I'm saying. There's a boy in the cell. Can I unlock him? Nope. Okay. Go past the cross, it drops my arm. So G to put it back into the inventory. There are several ways I can kill this guy here. Yeah, that is, it says I can poison the coffee, I can put the uh, connect the electricity to the faucet so when he turns on the water it'll electrocute him. And there's the third one which is I can drop the ceiling for him. So I'm not sure. They got busted. Yep, ET is a lifeline. 
Do I hold in life lines? I have. That makes me forget slightly. Okay, so let's do, start this again. Let's try not to get caught this time, so I don't like that. Let's do this again. Right, let's get straight in here. Right, um, let's poison the coffee. Oh, coffee. Uh, how do I poison the coffee? Ah! Oops. Can't be detected. Is he not detecting? The hell? Mm hmm. Oh, how did you? I'm just gonna go back to sitting back there. Right. Use pills and coffee. Okay. I fucked it up, didn't I? I fucked it up. You go down, fucked it up. Okay, well, this is going to be useless. Alright, oh, okay. Yep, I found it up. Okay. That's what I'm turning you on. And... Keep the... I'll attach you to that. Right. I don't know if this would actually work in real life. I'm not gonna try. That's got him moving. Right, and uh, let's watch the fireworks. Come on, you bastard. Drink your coffee. Zip. Murder. Oh, you crispy. Right, so there are loads of doors to open. Two there and one just around there. Well, might as just go through here, aren't we? Outfit back, got my uniform, so now to open the doors and let everybody out. Come on, we all need to be freed. We need to, all, you, you, all the crazy people need to be let out of their cells. Uh, they all need to roam free like the majestic little jackals they are. Right, the water as it spreads, there's another little crazy person. If I get one of those um, defibrillator things, and put, turn it on and put one thing there. As um, it will electrify, electrify the water, so anyone who walks in the water will then get electrocuted. Okay, and he is pissing on the flowers. As you would. And she told me that I okay, would. Okay, let's see all of these people break the shelf. Can't live with them. That's how I'm going to kill these people, they're breaking the shelf. Hey, hey. Okay. Why is the space between a woman's breath? Because you could easily fit another pair of tits. So there's a floor, so I need to go through here. <laughs> a good one, over here. Good one. 
Hey, I got one. One of these things. Drop on those things. Oh, no, 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 those things. What? Right, so we need to throw this thing here, seems to be, from what I can see. So I need to hit. No, I wasn't throwing throw, throw hard enough, so I need to hold that. That uh, wasn't aimed correctly, so. Let's uh, try this again. Oh, right, there we are, got it up. Right, now I need to get this thing through the vent. Oh, oh, oh. There we go, let's see how this goes. Just broke that. Ah, this is how it goes. Go on. Jesus, that is a big ass fight. I want you, and I want you. And then I see fire. Alright, I'm leaving that there guys, I hope you've enjoyed the video, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in part 2 of Lucius 2, thank you. Oh, I shot him right in the head! I think I'm wrong. I'm blocking the door, so he can't come in. <laughs>